what to do when iMovie crashes. Hi, I'm Brie Williams, the behavior changer. Normally I talk about behavioral science. Today I'm going to talk about what to do if you get that dreaded bouncing iMovie icon, or maybe you get the spinning wheel of death when you're looking at iMovie. It just won't load. Today I had the displeasure of spending two hours trying to get it started again. Now, in terms of technical credentials, I have none. I'm speaking to you as a novice. I want a computer that I switch on and the computer mysteriously works. The problem with a lot of the advice that I've been trying to trawl through, it's like a foreign language. I don't understand. So yes, I tried to restart. I tried to hold down particular keys, wiggling my left foot in a particular direction. But now I'm just going to take you through what has worked for me on a couple of occasions and it might work for you too. Right. So what do we need to do first? Click on Finder. Go to your Applications menu and scroll down till you see iMovie. Now this is where I get confused because I use a left-handed mouse, but I click my right mouse button so that I get a menu. And one of those options is Show Package Contents. So at this stage, you're not looking to click iMovie to open it. You're looking to click so that this menu pops up and you can show package contents. Once those package contents are mysteriously revealed, scroll down to Mac OS and you will find within that section iMovie and it's next to a little sort of black and green icon, at least in list view it is. Once you've identified that, double click and it will open something that is called Terminal. Now Terminal will go through all of this sort of hieroglyphic spiel and it might take a long time. I made this mistake a couple of times of thinking this was stuck, shutting it down and trying it all over again. Much better to set this in motion, walk away, come back at a particular juncture. I don't know how long it will take, say five minutes, 10 minutes. And by that stage, at least in my experience, miracle of miracles, my iMovie library has revealed itself and that's it. That's all I do in order to now restart iMovie. I hope it works for you, but more than that, I hope Apple actually fixes this issue because it is annoying. Of course, if you're interested in videos about what I normally talk about, behavioral science, please subscribe. Otherwise, I wish you very well in your video creation efforts.